Hey, this is Key. Welcome back to Messy Desk Productions. Tonight I'm doing a oriental candle um, to replace some blue candles that were in my living room. And since I'm changing the theme of my living room because I just moved, I'm changing the decor. So this is going to be an oriental candle. I know it looks white and plain and whatever right now, but we're going to make it pretty. So. Uh, let me adjust the camera here because you can't see it. Um, first thing I did was I took my Far East mat stack. Um, this is the like small one, um, the um, four four and a half by six and a half sheets. Anyway, um, I flipped through and found the page that matches my living room the best, which is this one. I don't know if you can see all the detail in it, but here it is. Anyway, um, so what I did was I pulled one of those out of there, threw it on top of my handy dandy scanner. And printed a copy of it. So now I have this um, page here and so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to add a stamp to it but I need a flat surface so I'm going to back you up a minute. Let's put this on a flat surface and get my stays on and my stamp. I'm using um, jet black stays on for this and my oriental stamp. Yeah, that's what it is. Mm -hmm. I use stays on. Um, it seems to be the best type of ink to keep the colors from running and like bleeding when I'm melting them. Okay, so I have stamped the paper. And I'm closing the ink so it don't dry. And there, there we have the paper. So now I'm going to bring you back over here. And I'm going to take my handy dandy candle and my handy dandy paper. And I'm sure there's nice high tech fancy ways of doing this, but um, I'm not nice high tech and fancy dancy. So I'm just going to hold it here and turn my heat gun on and melt it. Okay. I'm setting it down now because um, it's getting hot. Okay, now I'm going to let that half dry for a minute before I roll it. Usually I use wax paper and I cover the candle with wax paper and hold the wax paper like a handle. And um, what I have found when I do that is that I usually get bubbles and screw it up because I can't hold it right. Um, so I'm not using wax paper this time, I'm just melting it directly. Um, so since I'm doing that, I'm going to let the side dry just a minute before I roll it. Because it's not on a flat surface, I'm going to roll it just a little bit so that I have access to the other side of the paper. Since this candle seems to be a bit skinnier than most of the candles I work with. Okay, I'm going to do the other side now.
Okay. Um, I'll let that dry for a minute. So you can see now that I have the background matches the um, the um, Far East paper stock that I copied, and the stamp is crisp and clear. It's the Oriental signal or symbol for happiness. Um, this candle is one of a collection of three. Um, so I'm going to pause now and show you the collection together and in place now that it's done. Okay, so now that I've got this third candle done, I've got all, all three candles done and in place. And let me just back up here so you can see the final product. This is the picture frame for my oriental theme living room. And there you see the three candles on the three candle holders. Thanks for watching. Again, this is my messy desk.